right, hello, this is MN Trimp, and this is going to be a cure video on blue Donios. Uh, Donios come from Asia. They're, I would say, a great beginner species. Commonly, you find the zebra Donios. Um, these are basically almost like a variant of them, like a mutation. They are leopard, they're basically blue leopard Donio. They're blue leopard Donios because they have the leopard markings on them. As you can see, they kind of have like a steel blue coloration. Plus, these are the long fin varieties, so they have a longer fins. It's kind of funny when they, you see their fins all the way out. They kind of almost look like a little flying fish. Um, pretty easy to care for. Temperature range is probably around in the 70s. Good. Um, these guys are schooling fish. You usually want around six, five to six per group. Um, I'm not sure if they're a diver, dither fish. A dither fish basically means that they kind of let all the other fish in their aquarium know that it's okay to swim around, that there's no danger. Um, they like a good open, see I have a big open area right in the middle from the swim around. And then they got plants around that, so it's good. They like planted tanks. They also like to swim around the little tunnels they got in there for the shrimp. Um, they basically kind of eat just normal tropical fish food. Um, what else? The males and females. Males are actually smaller than the females. The females tend to be pretty big. Um, I haven't been accurately able to sex what I have. I believe I do have one big female. Because one of them is definitely a lot bigger. I can't really see where it goes right here. This is my, I believe my big female right in front here. I'm not positive. It could just be a big male. See that? I believe that's a male. The smaller ones are males. Any other ones are like really big, plump. The males tend to be skinnier than the females. Um, pretty good beginner fish. Easy to care for. Easy to breed. They actually, a lot of times, they're kind of similar to guppies where they kind of tend to breed pretty quickly. Um, a lot of times what people have happens is you'll shut the lights off at night and once they actually make sure when you turn the lights on in the morning, that's when they'll spawn, they'll lay eggs, and mate. So, a lot of times I've seen videos where people just like turn the lights on, all of a sudden they go look and the fish are just going at it. So. Um. Let's see, pH range. Probably around 7 to 8. Probably keep around there. I wouldn't see, I wouldn't, they're usually tend to be around the seven upper sevens. So I'm in a good range right now. Um can't think of anything. I just I probably highly recommend they're not as common as people they're not as common as the zebra donios. Even the leopard donios are a little more common than the these guys. These guys tend to be like I, I basically bought all five fish and the pet shop I went to does not have them anymore. They didn't get any more in, so pretty nice. So not too crazy colorful, but they're still pretty nice fish. So this is Eminem Shrimps. Till next time.